Hi, um, this is Mr. Roche. Uh, we are here kind of reviewing on shape concepts and this is how you shell a extruded part. So what we're going to do um, is, is shell this, this, this little cube. Like right now the cube is totally solid and like, like we're trying to make a box and the boxes are sort of hollow on the inside. So what we got to do is we got to shell this thing. Okay, that's what, that's what they, they, you call this in 3D world here. So the way to do this, there is a part, there is a tool up here called shelling. Okay. And we like that. Okay. So what we're going to do is um, we're going to use it. So what we have to do with, with, when you're using shell is you have to kind of specify something you want to shell. So I'm going to click on this and pick this part. So this entire part is considered something I'm going to shell and it turns orange. You can see how it turns orange and that's sort of fun, right? So then what we're going to do is we're going to hit the shell thing here. Okay. Now what it wants to know is the thickness of it. Okay. And if there's any faces we need to remove. Okay. And I think shelling implies like, like see like this one makes a kind of a hole. Um, I think there's a way to say that you just want it hollow and leave all the faces and that's cool. But a box is going to have an open face. So what we want to do is just, um, I want to click on the face I want to remove, but I'm going to be careful about this because my drawing or my view of the world isn't really what I want, right? So what I want to do is I want to look at it. I want to take off the top face like this one right here, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of orbit myself so that the top is facing up, right? And then I'm just going to hit this. Boom. And look at that. There it is. It's shelled. Now, one thing is that um, you have to be a little bit careful about this thing. This is like 0.1 of an inch, which is super small. It's one tenth of an inch. Um, so, um, you know, uh, bigger than a sixteenth, but smaller than an eighth. Um, it might be a little a little tight with the um, with the 3D printers that we have and stuff like that. And since this is our first project, I'm just going to make this a little bit bigger. I'm going to go like 0.2. Okay. Or uh, we could go to something like maybe like 0.15. Something like, whoa, <laughs> look at that. Um, that's not what I wanted. Um, I'm going to say 0 0.15. That's what I wanted. Okay. Something like that. So we get a, like a nice sort of lip around it, but it's thick enough for the 3D printer. And um, we have to, I have to sort of test the 3D printers, but but um, but that that's pretty good. If to be on the safe side, you could say 0.2, and you couldn't go wrong. I don't mind 0.2. That seems actually pretty good to me. So I might stick with that. But that's what you need to do. And then we're gonna say shell it. Oh, oh, it, oh I said it, skip it. I'm sorry. Let me put it back again. So again, to review, pick the part, um, pick shell, right? Pick your view. Get your top view showing. Whoop. Okay, like orbit it so you can see what's going on. Go to the faces you want to remove. Pick this one. Pick this like 0 0.2 and say uh, pick the checkbox instead of the X and boom there you go. You have a lovely shelled item and that's how you shell. Okay and then we're going to do some extra cool stuff um, to the box um, after this but that's the basic, basic look of it. Okay so thanks and talk to you later and this is shelling.